Section 1.3 is subtracting integers. Uh, the basic idea to subtract integers is exactly what it says here. Subtract integers by adding its opposite. Um, if I take a negative 4 and I subtract 6, I would turn that into a negative 4 plus a negative 6. Again, opposite here would make that uh, a negative 6. So just like we did last uh, section, I'm going to add a negative 4 and a negative 6, and that would become a negative 10. Uh, same rules apply that we did last section. Uh, you could take the absolute value of these, add them together, and then use, obviously, the negative, so negative 10. Uh, at its opposite, 6 minus negative 9. Anytime you have a subtraction of a, of a negative, it's really easy because then you just basically turn this into a positive. I would add the opposite, so it would add 9. 6 plus 9 would just be 15 some more. 3 minus 12 at its opposite. 3 plus a negative 12. Well, i got to go back to what we did last section, as I said. How do I go about doing this? Um, subtract the absolute values and use the uh, sign of the bigger number. So I'm going to subtract um, absolute value of negative 12 is 12, and I'm going to subtract 3, and I'm going to get 9 but I have to use the sign of the bigger number, which is a negative 12, so my answer would be a negative 9. Uh, kind of a mess, a lot here. I'm going to add the opposite, so I'm going to get negative 8. I'm going to add a positive 13 because it was a negative. Again, how do we do this? Did this last section. I'm going to take the absolute value of 13, absolute value of negative 8, so I'm going to subtract 13 minus 8, and I'm going to get 5. However, where am I? Am I positive or negative? Well, the bigger number is 13, and that was a positive, so it's a positive of 5. So there's my answer. It's important, by the way, you see how I kind of went step by step and set it up. Uh, I, I really recommend you do that so you don't get confused of, of where you are in your, uh, in your, in your problem. Uh, three practice problems for you to do here. Uh, I'd like you to try these, and we'll look at those tomorrow. Hope you followed along, and uh, you have a good night. Take care. Bye-bye.